Well guys, uh, good afternoon. Uh, we got a simple little fix here. Uh, basically on these school buses, uh, we have crossover mirrors and uh, after, you know, a few months, maybe years, uh, mirrors, crossover mirrors start getting a little wobbly. It's because they're uh, base, the little base uh, hold down, whatever you want to call it, bracket. Um, it's made out of plastic, so that plastic breaks and um, mirror starts coming, you know, shaking as you're driving. So drivers come in, report it. We have to repla replace the whole base on these. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Well, guys, uh, this is the actual base that we have to replace. Uh, they're pretty simple to do. We got six Phillips head screws, and then we have four mount screws that are Torx. So on these, I mean, it's pretty simple. Let me go ahead and get the tools ready. And basically, let's loosen these six bolts. Loosen them. You don't have to remove these. For the actual uh, four torx bits holding it to the base, it's a T30. We use our little impact little driver and back them all the way out. These you have to remove. You just kind of lift, spin around, and pop it right out. And as you guys can see, that crack right there is what makes it wobble. And this here is the left hand. So, get our new base, remove, remove the Torx bit off of this one, get us a Phillips head a little bit, loosen these up. Get the sucker into place, slide it up, turn it. And before you tighten this six, these six screws, we go ahead and get these little Torx bit bracket bolts and drive them into place. I get all four in first before I start tightening. Got the bit to a Phillips and snug these up a bit. Try and get them all. There you go, guys. That's a very simple and little easy fix. Let me get the other side real quick. Again, same thing guys. Loosen these.
change over to the T30 bit. see guys this one was really broken all right this one's here it's considered to be the right hand base got this little metal bracket that these little six Phillips head hold these are the ones that I anchor that mirror and keep it kind of sturdy go ahead and lift Get these four screws back in there. Swap out your bits, go to the T30. Again, and and there we go, guys. That is how we remove and replace our crossover mirror bases. Crossover mirror and the little base that holds it in place. That one right there. So, guys, I'm gonna call this one done. And thanks for watching, guys, and like and subscribe.